Oh, have I got a big announcement for you guys. There will be no more companies on our socials. What did you say? I don't know, but it's hilarious. What? No more company dinners or socials? Bingo, bingo, bingo. So, whenever I have to give my kids bad news, I say it like it's good news. So an example would be, I'm afraid the leg's gonna have to come off. <laughs> See? No events at all? None. Laser tag? None! What about the weekly escape room? Can't do it! Bring your therapist to work day? No, no, no. What the hell? We can still do like our kosher karaoke night though, right? Absolutely not. Why? Because our TNE budget doesn't reset until next fiscal year. How is that possible? Because someone spent everything trying to impress the sales team. Who could spend that much money in one day? Hey! hey. Guys! Oh, are we gossiping? Who are we talking about? Is everyone okay? Everyone seems to be not making direct eye contact, if, except for Jamie. Oh, yeah, everything's fine. Everything's fine and great. Let's say that that doesn't work. The fallback plan is toys. Huh? What I like to normally do is use educational toys. The reason I use educational toys, and you're gonna like this, parents, nobody wants to play with them. Who wants to learn fractions as a game? Nobody. Usually they play with them for like an hour, and then I keep the box and return them. That's a hack. Oh, this is one of my favorites! Oh, oh three bears went over the mountain. Three bears went over David, the mountain. David, look at me. Look at me. Three David, you're better than this. Mountain. And what do you think they saw? They saw another mountain. They saw another mountain. Oh, come on, guys! What did the bears do? Never mind. They, they went down the mountain, and then they went back up the mountain, and then they went down the mountain, and then they saw the mountain, and then they go down the mountain, and then they go up the mountain. And then they see another mountain and then they go up the mountain. And then they come down the mountain and they go up a mountain again. And then they see another mountain and then they go up again. Do they sleep? No, they're bears. Listen, Jeremy, you just get back to work. Kosher karaoke is gonna pop off tonight. It's tradish. You can't just cancel a tradition. What if we just started canceling holidays? Like, what if this year we were like, oh, we're not doing Columbus Day? Oh, shit. Actually, bad example. We shouldn't do Columbus Day. Is Sarah gonna come this week? Probably not, but that's her loss. And I'm not gonna cancel it just because one person can't come. Did me and Sarah used to be friends? Yes. Do I miss her as a friend? Yeah, yeah, definitely. I definitely liked her as a friend. Just as a friend, though. She wants to fly solo? Cool. Yeah, how'd that work out for Lance Bass? I'm looking at you, big dog. You broke up in sync, Lance. Sarah is Lance Bass. She broke up in sync. And I'm JC Chazes. Oh my god! How are you? Oh, 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 my fave work bestie is back. Lindsay, the senior from the new audit firm. At first we were enemies, but now we're best friends. I have her contact information in my phone. I, I bought it from Rocket Reach. I want to send a selfie to my mom. She was asking about you again. Your mom? You've talked yeah. to your mom about me? Sarah? Yeah, we're friends. In the same way that you'd be friends with your local barista. She knows my name, and I look at her name tag and pretend to remember hers. Did Sarah ask me to be a bridesmaid at her hypothetical wedding? Yeah, but if a day comes, when my barista decides to pour a little bit too much oat milk in my latte, I will write a Yelp review so scathing that I will make sure that she never pours in this town again. Oh, this old thing? This would be a writer's scarf. Every great writer has a scarf. When I took the SEC reporting manager position, I didn't realize just how creative the job was. I mean, I'm basically a writer. <laughs> and I'm working on the next great American novel, which just so happens to be a 200-page document full of financial data to inform investors of what it is that Sunriser does. When I'm writing the S1, I'm not thinking of just the data or what the government wants. I am thinking of the reader. I want my words to jump off the page. I want it to be filled with love and passion and sex and dinosaurs. You know what sets a good S1 apart from the others? It's not the numbers, you ignoramus. It's the poetry. And I am a poet. And don't you know it. I'm not gonna blow it.
Uh, yeah. Hey Dale, writer's fuel. Coffee. <laughs> keeps the brain sharp. Little writer's fuel to keep the creative juices going. Hey, Jamie. <clears throat> hey! Hunter! Yo, what's up, man? <laughs> Nothing, I'm just getting a little writer's fuel in the old system for the writing. Oh, nice. Dude, nice scarf. Is that new? It is new. Thank you for noticing. It's just a way to express my artistic side. You working out? No. <laughs> I mean, kind of. Okay. I, I ran from a dog last weekend. Oh, that's probably going pretty fast. Yeah. What are you doing later? <laughs> for real? Kosher karaoke is tonight. Everyone's gonna go. It's pretty much at max capacity, but I got one more slot open. I can slide it your way if you're down. You know, I always thought there was something between us. What? Um, but I wasn't sure how it would come to fruition. And for you to make the first move is a relief. Yeah, I'm not sure what you're talking about. I'm just talking about regular old karaoke, just microphone sure. on stage doing covers. Oh my God. I got yeah. it, well, loud and what, clear. I don't know what that was. I, I'm, I'm just caught off guard. You know what? Okay? This was a mistake, all this. This was a bad idea. Come on, don't back down now. No, 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 I'm gonna go just do not this. Okay, I need to get out of here. The scarf works. So, what's up? New job, new man. Let's talk about the list of internal control steps on Riser AI, hmm? I saw you at a birthday party last month. You know, I'm sorry I couldn't make it. I just never got the hmm. call or DM or text about it. Did you get my emails asking hmm. about it? You do realize we're billing you $350 an hour, right? Oh, hmm? come on. Don't be so uptight. What's the tea spill? Hmm. Hmm. Okay, fine. Hmm. Did Hunter ever ask you out or did he trip over his own dick? Do you think that's physically possible? I'll take that as a no. Oh, well, no, I'm, I'm actually kind of almost seeing someone, so. Aw, oh, that is so cute. Who's the lucky guy? Oh, uh, you know, I mean, he's, he's pretty cute. He's, we haven't really done much yet, you know. Mm -hmm. um, we're waiting on some test results. Test results of what? Oh, um, the DNA test results. We're, we're worried we're related. Best case scenario, like we're fifth cousins, but um, worst case scenario, we're, we could be like long lost siblings or something. No, but it's okay. It's just, it's this one cousin with the same name. I'm just not sure. She's been to, to my family reunion. He thinks that she's been to his family reunion. I mean, oh. we, you know, look kind of similar. And then, you know, we start talking about, you know, our, our Bubby's villages in, in Poland. And then, you know, it comes out, there were only like 30 people in the village, so. Ladies and gentlemen, unfasten your seatbelts and move up about the cabin. Hey, work wifey, how's it going? I'm Marty, rhymes with party. This is Lindsay, remember my best friend I was telling you about? It's Lindsay. Yes. Lindsay. It is Let's very go. nice to meet you, Marty. It's a pleasure to meet you. You smell great, like corn syrup. Not that I'm smelling you. I, just... I love your hair, eyes, and skin color. What's your background? French, French English, English, Scottish, and Jewish. Jewish. <laughs> uh, We're the same. Yeah. Hey, uh, let me know when we get the test results up and refreshing like, all the time. I know, the wait is so intense. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, let me know. <sighs> so, so. Work wifey and possibly related. Interesting. Well, we'll see. In six to eight weeks. Yo, yo, my two handsome 4chan boys. Oh, what the no, f Someone's dude. in here. Someone's in the bathroom. Get out. We've moved full time into the metaverse. We eat, sleep, drink, go to the bathroom. All in the metaverse. We're even tackling IT issues. At this point, we're metaverse moguls. Corner. In order Chef to be super corner. successful corner. in the metaverse, corner. you have to leave behind. a lot of things okay. behind. Family, Yay! friends, finances, animals. I just left my cat in the middle of the street. I haven't even seen my wife and kids. I had to leave them behind. Don't miss them. The cool thing about the metaverse is that you can be whoever you want to be. Yeah, just two venties. Oh, my name? Julio. My AVI? It looks like Trunks from Dragon Ball Z. Mine looks like current day Scotty Pippen. What is happening here? What is going on? Marge Simpson, come back to bed. Lewis Griffin and the mom from American Dad are in here. Come on. Jason, can you get my back? Do you guys want to come to kosher karaoke tonight or not? Kosher karaoke? What does that even mean? Okay, you know what? Forget I was here. 
This is my nightmare, literally. Hunter, just be honest. Do you want a bath, bro? See you bring the heat, the heat. I wanna see you bring the flavor. The flavor. Come on, let's move it. Sarah! We're doing shots against the clear blader, and our ratio is <laughs> You gonna rally? I'm gonna have to say ratio no to that one. And no, it's just that our team usually does kosher karaoke. It, it's awesome. Uh, team? Where's your team now, Sarah? Yeah, oh, I thought we were getting dinner, just the two of us. I got a Rizzy at Outback Steakhouse. Um, let's just do it another night. You think you can get us in later? At the Outback at Steakhouse? Outback? Okay, yeah. See you guys. My main man, Pretty Ricky. Now I know you of all people are coming to kosher karaoke tonight, right? Not now, Hunter. <laughs> we are in the middle of a sprint, okay? Writers are working. What? Ricky, you write? Uh, I'm kind of working on my tell-all book on leadership. It's kind of a Bob Iger vibe. Huh. The guy who wrote Old Time Rock and Roll? I know who Bob Iger is. Why do you have so many feathers? Don't question the process, Hunter. It's a writerly thing. I'm just afraid that you're gonna get rabies or something. I'm not going to get rabies. I've already had rabies. I'm immune. So nobody wants to come to kosher karaoke, I guess. He, he doesn't need us. Well, yeah. He's got tons of friends. Yeah, you got tons of friends. <laughs> yeah, no, yeah, I got, I got so many friends. I got tons of friends. If I had any more friends, I'd be a sociopath, dude. I got so many freaking friends, dude. And look at that, my boy Rico just hit me up. We got some big Billboard Top 100 type shit going off. We're making a music video that's gonna pop off on TikTok. Speaking of TikTok, we gotta get to the end of the sprint. I think I got writer's block. So what if everyone here is too busy for me, all right? If they don't come to kosher karaoke, they're the ones missing out, dog. all right? I got tons of friends on LinkedIn. You should see my LinkedIn DMs, it's crazy. I'm like the champagne poppy of LinkedIn. Recruiters are thirsty for me right now. Just throw me job offers. Just, they wanna take me to like dinners and buy me drinks. And sometimes I go, I let them pay for everything and then I just go Casper. I just go ghost. They never hear from me again. And sometimes they throw out some pretty good job offers. I can't lie. And lately, some of them have been looking kinda good. I, I was thinking the new Minions movie might be good. I've already seen it. Are you serious? I'm sorry, I saw the midnight premiere. Hi Sarah. Just confirming that you have control over legal and finance reviewing those sales contracts before signing and client onboarding? Um, well, actually, we got the sales team using the new expense platform. Yeah. It was such a struggle. We did this whole golfing thing, and Tupac was there. Yeah. That's not what I asked. I asked if you have control over legal and finance reviewing those sales contracts before signing and client onboarding. Hm. Uh, no, not yet. Ah. What are you typing? Nothing. I see. Doop, 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 doop. Sounds like that went well. <laughs> Yo! It did. Whoa! What? What is... What is all this? What the hell, bro? Your call time was an hour ago, where have you been? My call time? What's up with this crew? What's our budget? Art has no budget, Hunter. What is she doing here? This is my girl, Michaela. She is a visionary. Oh. Best artist slash director I've ever worked with, bro. <laughs> Hands down. No, yes. Stop, baby. What's going on, dude? What, are you, what is the suit you're wearing? It's my CGI suit. What are you planning to CGI into? The effects. The, what? Look, I saw The Hobbit. You just now saw The Hobbit? Yes. And? And f***ing rocked. There's a multitude of things you can do with computers and cameras. I'm thinking Beyonce's Lemonade mixed with Beyonce at Coachella. Fire. Is this like the Twilight Zone? What have I missed? You two are in like a monogamous, committed relationship all of a sudden, and she's directing our music video? Yeah, and rapping on it. Oh, and rapping on it? How? The song is finished. Oh, we made some minor tweaks. You made some minor tweaks. This is an 
entirely different video. Okay, this is an entirely different song. No, no, dude, no. I just punched up a few things. Mess with the chorus, the bridge, the refrain, some of the melodies, and all the lyrics. Your simping is ruining everything. And not that I care or anything, but is this kind of clip even gonna fit in with all this green screen stuff? <laughs> Hunter, this is the green screen stuff. Everything is CGI. Hey, listen. You're gonna be really excited about this. I got you something. What, what is this? This is your own green screen suit. So you can be a part of the video. I don't wanna wear a green screen suit. I wanna shoot the video like we agreed upon. Well then give me it back then. Oh, it's like that? Yeah. But guess what? You look stupid in that suit. I look cool. I look like Benedict Cumberbatch, fucker. You're gonna be in this video. I'm not gonna be in the video, dude. Don't do this. Don't cry. <laughs> No, because when we were at Barstow, you said we were never gonna not be friends and work on shit together. Now you... Okay, I'm out, okay? Of the video, of the band, I'm out. Oh, and by the way, both of you are uninvited from kosher karaoke, okay? Yeah, that's right. Rabbi Mendelssohn, he's gonna schwitz when he hears that I slept all the way over here for you, schmuck, and this, shiksa. You can't use those terms if you aren't Jewish, Hunter. Come on, people, let's get it going. Bilbo style. I'm happy. I'm sorry? I'm happy. You know, I swore I'd never leave Audit. Didn't want to leave the team, but I did. And it's really, really worked out. Great. Regrets? Zero. Fantastic. It is fantastic, but... You know, I gotta say that those nine years in audit were some of the best years of my life. Mm. But so many good memories, so many laughs. Do you remember the laughs? <laughs> Do you remember the day that Shaq brought two apples to work? <laughs> I was like, two apples? Okay, Granny Smith. And he was like, <laughs> Do you remember the day I accidentally brought my cat to work? and it scratched you on the arm. <laughs> oh, you were so mad at me. Yeah, of course I was. That was very painful. Yeah. But, you know, with a little distance, we're able to laugh. I was severely injured. Yeah, they made me put my cat down after that. Yeah, my lawyers and I had to fight that. Yeah. <laughs> Do you remember? So how's that S1 coming? What, what? The S1? Oh. You haven't even started it, have you? Uh, well, hmm. I'm ruminating on it. It's all hmm. up here. You do know that your first draft is due tomorrow. Yes. Kosher karaoke is lit, all right? You put on your kippah, you get some schnitzel, eat some challah, and you hit the stage. And that's when the rabbi comes up, he kisses you on the cheeks for like, you know, a few minutes. Coworkers won't leave you hanging on kosher karaoke night. Just you and Rabbi Schwitzel doing Patti LaBelle songs, ripping shots of Manischewitz. Kosher karaoke is lit whether Sarah comes or not, whether anybody comes or not, okay? So I don't need anybody else to go but me. But like, what are y'all doing tonight? What did the fish say when he ran into some seaweed? What? Kelp, kelp, kelp! <laughs> <laughs> I'm a She's effectively breaking me down in a way that she's never done before. Everybody loves you. Everybody loves you. But you f this place. Lindsay, um, you know, we're, we're a team, right? Absolutely not. I'm an internal auditor here to advise on corporate controls. Right, but um, you're not currently auditing us. This is just an initial review. Exactly. I'm here to review the work that you have or well, <laughs> haven't done and make recommendations to the leaders to make improvements on the protocols according to the COSO framework. Great, yeah. Um, so then why don't you just send those notes right on over to me. Mm -hmm. You're not a leader, Sarah. I'm a county operations manager. 
my notes, my thoroughly detailed notes, will be sent to your CFO, Jessica, and Dave, your controller. Well, um, perhaps you could just show me what they say so that I can make the changes now. That's not how that works. Sure. Mm-hmm. Oh, that, you look like you have low battery. This is crazy! Stop! Stop it! Stop it! This is, what are you doing? Stop! Get it out of your mouth! Stop oh. it! Stop oh. it! My God! This is what How did I force your hand? You flew here like a crazy person! You just wait till I write. All of that on my notes. Absolutely. Eat paper. Hey, Fancy Lancy, uh, I'm sort of in it right now. I need to know, how does the sales team stay up all night with a client and then get back on the phones at 8 a.m.? Like, how do you do it? Like, how do you focus? Well, I think it's a job done like a little bump of the old cold brew nitro. You know what I'm saying, pal? Cold brew nitro? Mm -hmm. I've heard of that. Yes, well, I have to write the whole S1 tonight, um, so I guess what I'm saying is I could go for a cup. If well, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I got a guy. Oh, yeah? <laughs> now, how much? How much you need? Oh, I need it. I need... We're going all night, so... Eight ounces at least? Maybe oh, 16? Well, if you want the good shit, let's see. 200 bucks a gram, 28 grams an ounce, because I'm no accountant, but... Yeah, about 45 Gs. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so sorry. I... <laughs> I will get that replaced. Uh, how much did that cost? $800. You know what? I think that'll come out in the wash. And the skies on a cloudy or gray. Hey, hey. Dave, is, is everything okay? Oh, everything's fine. Okay, well, you know, I just want to let you know that Lindsay was requesting to put some controls on the sales contracts, so wow. maybe we could... This is all just about work to you, isn't it? Well, yeah, we're at work. Yeah, I know. Obviously, we're at work, but our fam bam is just coming apart at the seams. And you don't have the decency to pretend to even care? Well, well there's no heart in there. That's the problem. That's the problem with your whole generation. There's no heart in there. There's just a big money sign that pumps blood to your vital organs. I'm just trying to get ahead of a small detail in Lindsay's report. I also may have eaten her notes. You ate her notes? Oh my god, I can't even afford to, to feed my accountants. They're eating paper. I'm the worst freaking parent ever. Come on. No. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. What's happening to the world? Nothing. We're still together. We're still a fam bam. Not really. Nobody likes you now. No one likes me now? No. Today is not going as planned. Okay, my, my old work bestie, Lindsay, hates me. I'm gonna get fired and I have Dave snot on my shirt. <laughs> Hunter. Hey, Lindsay. What you doing? Oh, shit. Um, I'm going to go do kosher karaoke by myself. Oh, that's fun. Yep. Um, do you want to hang out with me tonight? I have the company card and I have a free evening. <laughs> oh, wow. You, you want to come kosher karaoke? Yeah. Are you OK? This is, I'm sorry. This is like the most attention you've ever given me. I, I, do you have like little time to live or something? I want to spend time with you. Do you not want to spend time with me? No, I, I, I definitely do. OK, then let's do the kosher karaoke thing that you just said. Yeah, OK. What does that mean? What, uh, what makes karaoke kosher? There's like specific rules, you mm -hmm. know? Baruch Atah, Adonai, Elohim. There has to be a rabbi there mm -hmm. to like certify how kosher it is at all times. You can't sing songs like Black Cow by Steely Dan and Milkshake by Khalees back to back. You got to wait six hours in between. OK. And after that, it's just regular karaoke. My favorite's the thong song. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah. The thong song. That yeah. was supposed to be funny, right? Right, yeah, no. So I yes, laughed because no. it was supposed to be funny. Was right. it not supposed to be funny? I don't know. I take the laughter back if it wasn't supposed to be funny. But if it was supposed to be funny, then I, I like laughing at the things that you say that are funny. I gotta be honest, I'm terrified right now. I have a bad feeling, but let's just see what happens. After you. Cool, yeah. You said, want one bag? Yeah. You're like an air marshal. Is that a compliment? 
Oh yeah, Sarah messed with the wrong auditor. Perhaps she doesn't remember in the time when she brought me a new trial balance at midnight, but I do. I have not forgotten. <laughs> and nothing would cause more damage than stealing Hunter away from her. You can't spell fun without F U, Sarah! You ready? To rumble? I uh, thought we were gonna go to dinner. Yeah, yes, um, well, I canceled the res at um, Outback Steakhouse. Well, well, we'll just make a new reservation. Yeah, uh, well, yeah. I mean, Outback's not gonna let us walk in, but you know what? I know uh, the host at TGI Fridays. No, I, I, yeah, let's do that. All right, sweet. Um, yeah, let me just... I'm, I'm excited for our date. Date? Um, yeah. Uh, then away we... Go. We can hold hands if you want. Yeah. I'm a wreck, she's a mess. I confess I should walk out the door. I finished the S1! Ugh. Starbucks was having a fire sale on cold brew. Way cheaper than what Lance said. That guy's an idiot, and I will beat him up. I did it, and I did it on a typewriter. Which means there's one hard copy. Like a true artist. Oh boy, oh boy, that almost got out. Oh, f***ing hell! I think it's salvageable. Big game. Big watch. Big chain. Big cause. With my photo finish, crooked business like an orthodentist. Calisthenics for like 20 minutes. Do my fitness, then my academics. Woo! Yeah, I need my dollars and billies. You need to take my Achilles, or it sound like I'm popping a wheelie. Woo! Medical, 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 man, it can get theoretical. Uh, yeah. What if my body and body of work are identical? Cheesy, yeah. I like Parmesan with oregano. Easy, yeah. I want to lick down my envelope. This song goes out to the girl uh -huh. with the brunette hair. Wait, hold up. This girl has blonde hair and blue eyes, bro. I'm not even an accountant, but I respect you so much that I Googled all these times. Okay, I'm concerned we're not talking about the same person, but... Charlie is an accountant, attend with loads of talent. Won't do your taxes, mom. So please stop asking. Smarter than us, I was. I'm gonna wipe her up. Haters can just give up. I wanna excel for you, baby. Promise not to crash. I wish I could be look you up so we could bring it back. Because I wanna be all up in your balance sheet. You got the ass that I need. Expense Chipotle, it's on me. Cut! This is not my vision! Let me show you how it's done. Name's Michaela, and I'm a bitch, but I'm also a savior. Well, my behavior is a reflection of my work that my words cut sharp like a chainsaw. I'm an outlaw, save the world with my grind and my foot spa. Take my CPE credits at the day spa, and I'm a tax law, sipping on haters' blood like track. Babe, that was so hot. <laughs> Thank you, baby. My moon is rising. What the f is going on? Shawty is an accountant, attend with loads of talent. Won't do your taxes, mom. So please stop asking, smarter than us I was I'm gonna wipe her up, haters can just give up Cause we're everlasting, Shawty is an accountant Attend with loads of talent, won't do your taxes, dad So please stop asking, smarter than us I was I'm gonna wipe her up, haters can just give up Cause we're everlasting Hold on, did Michaela get more studio time than I did? I had to record this on my AirPods. Uh, I'm so gonna win an MTV Video Music Award for this. I get it now. You replace me. You replace me with Michaela. Dog, you doing dirt. Rico, you a hoe for that. You a hoe for that. You a whole ass hoe for that. Oh, this is some bullshniz. I gotta be honest, Hunter. I'm, I'm caught up right now, man. <laughs> I'm caught up, my dog.